Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. It's the 10th. Nothing too big happening today. Now, let's see here. Uh, yep, I don't even think I'm concerned with luck, am I? We don't really care. Uh, but we'll check anyway. What have we got? Yeah, I'm very happy. Good enough. All right, we've got lots of espresso. This is a good thing. And let's get out there and see what we have going on. Uh, all right, good morning, kiddo. Morning. Let's grab uh, a gift for your mother here. Thank you, I really love this. I have to go to town today. Don't work too hard and eat something good for lunch. We will try. Oh, wow, okay, those are all gold stars, so they're burbling nicely. Um, all right. Yeah, there's been uh, lots of great suggestions of things I should do. I definitely, I have my work cut out for me in the next little bit here. Greetings from Calico Desert. Come visit soon, I'm getting really bored out here. I've included a gift from the desert. You come thank me in person, Sandy. I will eat that soon, Sandy. That looks uh, delicious. Hey, kitty cat. Uh, have some water. Yep, okay. We're all good. Alright. Oh boy. So we've got ourselves a few uh, ancient fruit here. This is good. Everything else is looking good. Wonderful. Oh yeah, there's a lot of stuff on the trees. Yeah, a lot of comments about um, what, what I should be processing in which way. Uh, and it sounds like you know, there's a lot of ways you can cut it. I think some of it is just some things are going to take longer than other things. Some things are more efficient one way or another. We'll make slightly more. Um, I think I will probably stick to the, the fruits and vegetables keg preserve char division mostly and then try to remember some of the exceptions. Um, and we'll process pretty much as much as we can uh, that way. And I'll start consolidating uh, inventory more here. Um, that was a, that's a process, a work in progress, as it, uh, it takes time as we slowly move things to where exactly we want them. Um, let's see here. Grab those. How much room do I have? Not much. Okay, I could fit more cherries, right? I can't fit more of those or more of those. Okay. Oh, hold the phone. There was more coffee right here. Can't leave the beans on the, uh... There we go, and you... Oh, I can't even get that, whatever grade that is. Ultra-grade coffee beans. Not for this world. Okay. Those things can go away. Uh, nothing else here, I really... Oh, right, we went to the movies! <laughs> I completely... I was like, why do I have, like, no inventory space? Other than the usual reasons. Because we went to the movies. That's lovely. Alright. Now this mess here, I'm not going to consolidate any of this too much. I will get selling off some of this. Um, again, I did sell off a lot at, at one point, but yeah, I have a pile of like various things. When I do the great sell-off, I'll plunder. And then, in terms of these things, um, you know, I've, this is just like ground food fishy sort of resources or ocean resources uh, this has become kind of a miscellany machine thing you know like it's kind of coherent <laughs> the seeds do not belong here um, and then this I was keeping high grade stuff for a little while of for, like before I had uh, iridium grade of everything or various things I just kept one of each good thing so this should be cleared out that is the one chest and then this this is all fish uh, it's kind of like a little of everything. Uh, this one is the one chest that is a disaster, for sure. This one does need clearing out because uh, I don't need all of these things here. And uh, in terms of what I want to take with me, well, at this moment, nothing really. <laughs> but I do need to go and sell, like, some of the things. Could, did I... Yeah, see, I have weapons chest and shoe chest and all this. I, again, I do need to go sell stuff. Low priority. I, I was kind of keeping things because I wanted to, uh, as we were exploring blending uh, different weapons and things together, it was nice to have extras. I'm going to put those extra things in here for the moment. And then, uh, and that's all Christmas decorations. I wonder if the, do we have room? I almost feel like some of these things, the futan bear and the small Junimo plush. I could put these out in the island house. They might look good out there. Because, I mean, they aren't, strictly speaking, a, uh, a winter thing. 
all the decisions. And uh, it had been suggested to have a nice, uh, one of the big um, uh, fish tanks in here. Um, that would look kind of cool. Also that I haven't got a fish pond yet with um, uh, crabs in it. And uh, yeah, I hadn't even thought about that. Okay, so let's get out here. What do I have for eggs now? I don't even have a stack of them on me, surprisingly. Okay, there's 29 there, I guess. Oh, there's 31. Let's do the 31. All right. That'll cover a few. We still have 13 more. All right, and I'm gonna leave you. What do we have here? Uh, yeah, it's these amounts are just not all that compelling, are they? Wow. So this, yeah, I could leave this mostly alone, I think, for a bit. I, we're getting to that point. Um, don't really need. And where's the other one? There we go, just to fill these up. I think we kind of hit that point now where it's like, we don't really need all the things. Uh, okay, now our little critters here. Yeah, it must be that they will not lay on the paths because I mean, they do keep it pretty concentrated. They're depending where they make it to. <laughs> I'm gonna need to clear those out. So yes, uh, I could decide what, what my original thing was, what I went with was different colors of water. And that was what I was experimenting with when we originally got going was like what just kind of looked cool um, more than anything. And then some of these, I you know, don't really need to have going. Um, we got the Void Salmon up there, Slime Jack, the Legendary, um, like the, this one here, don't know that I need. Um, the ones that give me interesting things, like this one will give me the Spicy Eel once in a while, which is kind of good, because then we could just, you know, use Spicy Eel Meal. Doesn't really matter. So when I go to build another uh, hen house or something here, uh, whatever I go with, we'll have uh, lots to work with there. Hello. Indeed. Okay. Now. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'll just put in fifty-one of these. Uh. Now what is it? It's just saying generic mayonnaise. Thirty-two. What did I? I don't even remember what I put in here. Oh. be interesting to see. Like on a row like that, if I am getting multiples, it would be a lot. All right, let's just leave these here, I think. I'm not going to bother with the other ones. I'm just going to run away. That's what we're going to do. Let's go dump off our stuff, and then I want to head out and see how everything's doing on the island there. Um, boop, boop, boop. Okay. There's so many things we could be uh, doing now. Um, so what it was my... All right, I have 19 days for that. And I have to do this pumpkin quest. That's the other main thing. So, right, I gotta let that thing ride here. Okay, good, we got some more coffee beans. Wow, all of the, uh, the mangoes and bananas have come in. It's a tremendous amount of stuff. Okay, let's drink some more coffee, how about? All right, I was wanting to go and deal with the crab traps out in the uh, the other area because, um, and, oh, and somebody had said the nectarines should go in the uh, preserve jars, I think, instead of the kegs, I believe. I think that was what it was. It was like fruit, but they were an exception, maybe, <laughs> maybe, possibly. Let's get up here. Yeah, it's still really interesting that the uh, the fodder doesn't seem to do anything out here. I really, I would have thought it would do something. All right, let's get our haul here. And again, I you know I as as much as I am kind of trying to max out my income on this playthrough at this point, I'm not going to stress too much over it. Uh, you know, we're not going to be doing a perfect. Uh, on anything. So I 
yeah, it's uh, we're not going to beat ourselves up if we don't pick the the most expedient way to to get income. We're past that point. We're we're good. But it's it's fun to you know get ridiculous, but whatever. Now the okay star fruit seed. I don't even know why. <laughs> I think I'll just leave these here. I think I was using those out here. Um. Yeah, and in terms of these other decorative elements. I was going to, okay, where do we want to put this? We'll put this here. Can I put anywhere else? There you go. And the, this little critter. That's cute. Uh, you. And what else do we have? There's another one. There's two of them. Oh, you guys can hang out together, okay? And then we've got uh, this, this tune one here. That's nice. That livens up the place a little bit. You need that. Oh, okay, more coffee beans. All right, and then, yeah, again, we've just mostly consolidated our seeds out here, so I'm just gonna leave all of that well enough alone. And all of this, we got processing in due course. Uh, again, not gonna worry too much about that. All right, uh, yeah. If for once, it's nicer out here than it is on the island. That's a, that's an amazing thing. Um, okay, and then let's get these going here. And how are we looking in here? Do we have... Uh, no, we got stuff. Stuff for bubbling and brewing. Okay, so we've got the good grade in here. We'll do that. Pineapple should be going to the island. Uh, well, and melons, I don't remember which way melons could go. I think those... Yeah, I don't know. There, again, the exceptions. Uh, let's, uh, you know, I'll just put those with me so I remember to take them. And... Whatever, I think the rest I will... The melons I might move. But the rest I'm not going to worry about. Now, I'm not going to worry about the critters here. Um, what else do we want to get checking on? I could go and check maybe on the... Uh, right, I, you know, I'm trying to... It's fine. I have so many thoughts of things. That's what's bizarre, is that you would think at this point I would completely have, like, just no nothing to do in this series, but, like, there's just so many things to do in the series. I wanted to move the greenhouse. Uh, there'd been a good suggestion to move the coffee shop closer to the house and, like, decorate it a little bit. I like that. Um, I guess I could get rid of the hardwood trees here. I don't know. I, I kind of like this, the, you know, the having a little bit of nature in between is nice. That's... Uh, Stylish, stylistically, it's kind of pleasant. Um, I could put it more just centrally here. I mean, I've just been kind of using the space up because I simply, um, you know, I didn't want to keep them all over here, but it does need its own separation, I think. So what I could do is if I move this over, I could have, uh, I could move the mill over or something. That would be, that would be a thing we could do. I'm trying to think what's, you know, yeah, how, what, What's going to look good? What's going to be the easiest? Let's get rid of um, while we're at this. Let's clear this out so that I don't have fodder growing here. And then we'll be able to um, work at, when I get a moment, with Penny. Penny. Robin. <laughs> when I get a moment with Robin, we'll be able to do something. Well, those look nicer. It's funny how when you pick it up, it looks different. Uh, and then these here. Yeah, I'm... I don't know what uh, whether or not I want to be smelting down any more stuff or not. That is the question, isn't it? How are we looking? I got 25. Um, also, I don't know that I need any more stone. I think we're maybe good, so I could probably stop deconstructing stone. Uh, quite, yeah, what do I want, right? So, in terms of kegs, I feel like on the island, I'm just about maxed out on kegs. Um... The bee houses, you know, I don't know. I got to deal with more of those. Crystallariums, I, you know, I could always put down more crystallariums, but do I really need to? Is the big question. Preserve shards, yeah, I don't know that I need more of those. Don't I don't really need more of any of the machines particularly, do we? So let's see here. Um, if I'm not going to worry too much about the raw ingredients, then, 
yeah, I don't need to be worrying about deconstructing or any of that at the moment. Solar panels would be nice if I put more of these out on the island. I mean, they do, uh, you know, just produce batteries, and that's pretty good. Uh, in terms of what they use, I mean, 5 gold, 5 iron, and 10 refined quartz, they use a lot. Uh, comparative to this, which uses 5 gold, 2 iridium, and 1 battery pack. I mean, the crystallarium are pretty lightweight, really. Um, they're just that gold bar, but then we could still start flipping over uh, in terms of our ability to transmute stuff. We could make 66 uh, gold bars. Um, and uh, we could make some six, yeah, from that. So I don't know. <laughs> I'm totally torn. And on the iridium, I mean, I could make 200 more crystallariums with the number amount of iridium I have. So if a 66 would only get me 12 more crystallariums, that'd be a total of 21. Uh, maybe worth doing, but I, I could also use to go mining, I think, for a little bit more stuff. Anyway, that's uh, my... my my logic stream there of what I'm trying to accomplish I think with all of that and in terms of all of these then do I want to have all of these out um, for smelting for breaking down trees probably not I think I can get rid of this side at least so I'll put these away and then if I need to haul out a few more I'm sure we can do that and then that buys me some space here I'm gonna take these deconstructors out of the way as well because this should be ample space to put something down, I think. Well, I might look at that. Okay, and then we'll put our machines here. Put the stone in the house. Or in the shed. There we go. So yeah, we have, we've got 8 billion stone. Uh, I'm going to put the stairs back here in my mining chest where they belong. And we'll take all of the hats and we'll put those away. Hats that we can't really do anything with, except wear. <laughs> Thankfully, we don't really need to go for more of those. That is good. Um, right. Yeah, and the duck feathers, I'm assuming we just sell? I'm trying to think of what duck feathers are even. Are they in anything? I don't really even... At this point, I can't think of a use for duck feathers. Is there a lure or something that we can use? There was gifts to Leo, but I mean, outside of that. Uh, yeah, I don't know. And I still do want to go and clear the crab pots just so I'll, I, I gotta continue with my excessive amount of uh, crabs and such. How are we looking? So, uh, where are crab cakes? Oh, I'm not even seeing them. Oh, there they are. Right, so we'd have zero crabs tucked away there. That's a surprising uh, thing. Okay, let's put these hats in here. Alright, and then let's go and... There was some comment about uh, you can move the kids' beds around. And... Uh, I'm gonna move these beds. This is a nice little spare room down here. Now, if you take, you get rid of these, oh, hey, can you move? Hi, you can't because the kids are sleeping. <laughs> so I was thinking about the kids' beds. I was like, you know, you have the kids' beds. Could we just put them down here? What's interesting is you could go for a jungle theme here, but these kids' beds, um, if these in fact are the kids' beds, I don't know that they are. I, I was going to think about moving the kids' beds down here, because then it would just be easier. Then we could move the, uh, this upstairs room, because we already got rid of the crib. We could turn it into something like a little bit more cool, I think. Because um, this isn't the most useful space. We could make a fun little kids' room. I don't know. That was a thought. And then uh, the fish tanks, I guess, is a question of whether or not I have more of those kicking around. And I don't need all those bone machines, I don't think, really. I like how it tries to get rid of stuff. It's like, no, I don't have any more room. Okay, hold up. Now the golden pumpkin I'll just throw in here as well. Uh, cons consolidation. I don't need any of that. Alright. 
And it, I'll leave the smelters here, because why not? We may be using them at some point in the future. Uh, and I do need to do some path fixing. Exotic double bed. Yeah, so I've got to figure out where I want to store my furniture. Um, I think we. I still need a chest in the house that's just going to be a furniture chest for ex excess furnituring. All right, and... Anything else that I needed to move in here? Well, we've got seeds that I was going to throw out on the island with the other island stuff. And that there is a lot of mining things here. Uh, the, t the rice shoots and the taro tubers I'll take to the island. Um, the mahogany seeds, I don't know where I want to plant those. I should plant those out. It's worth doing. And the slime eggs. You know, frankly, I, I really shouldn't be giving them any more. <laughs> Like, they, they, we don't need more slime, do we? We have so much slimage happening. Let's go dump the things off here. And I want to see what is uh, also going on um, down at the beach and see you know, how much stuff are we looking at inventory-wise. Okay, let's put the rice shoots here. And... Oh, okay, there's... Oh, right, and the super fertilizer I was just using around the house. I don't need that out here. Unless I plan on filling this house full of stuff, which I don't think I do. I don't think we need to do that. Okay, so I'm going to put... Oh, that's too big? Wow. Okay, uh, we'll make maybe a spare bedroom over here. And uh, I don't know which one we go with. It seems like a thing. I don't know, because you, you can't have the kids out here, can you? I have no idea. I'm so uh, such adult on the uh, the possibilities that this has opened up. Like I don't I'm really. Yeah, there's so many things I'm sure people are doing that are interesting um, with the island stuff that I'm not even thinking about. All right, so let's head over. I wanted to take a peek at the beach and then see how bad is it. <laughs> it's bad. I know it's bad. Oh, whoop, wrong, wrong direction, but you know what, that's, uh, that's how it goes, that's okay. It's, uh, no idea why I chose to come out to the beach, it looks nice. That's the problem with that one. It looks good, you're like, oh, let's go to the beach. And... Yeah, I guess, uh, you know, like, again, if at some point I do want to start just ripping down, uh, ores, I guess we could do that. We are at a point where I could do some more mining, but like fun mining, not uh, necessity mining. Necess uh, fun mining's good. Okay, and now let's just go back because I really didn't want to come here. <laughs> All right, then let's go and uh, get this thing. Yeah, definitely not. Uh, I always um, in the other playthrough, getting uh, accustomed to. Um, our, uh, oh, look at them. Pelicans going to town here. Well, there's enough stuff. Getting accustomed to uh, zipping home, and then in that one, it's like, no, you don't get to go home. You get to go to uh, wherever we're going to drop you off. Yeah, I may as well grab a few things, sure. But they'll be full again tomorrow. And then this, my whole recycling processing project was pretty good. Uh, we definitely filled the town, but it did take an entire day to recover all of the stuff. So I, what I should really do is I should think about simplifying that. Uh, it's it's excessive. I wrapped the whole town in recycling, and I don't need, I don't know that we need that anymore. Now that I've like littered every location, that was more of a let's see if we can, and well we did, <laughs> and then that was a lot. I feel like. Uh, I looked at this before, I'm pretty sure. What was the... If I were to, say, get rid of crab pots, what would I get? Copper. Yeah. So we could get back, you know, hundreds of copper and then turn that into iron and then turn that into gold or something, but I don't know that I want to. If there's a big win there or not. Again, I, yeah, I don't have a, a super big objective 
um, with with the machines and stuff at this point. I think because we've produced so many things, um, and we we do have so many kegs, it's I always hit that weird point in, in all these games where you're like, do I need more of the thing? And invariably, I go, yeah, probably, and then I make way too many. But uh, like this one is an interesting one because it does serve its sort of autonomous purpose. It does its own thing, and it just it's you're like, that's yeah, cool. We'll just let the uh, We'll let the game deal with its own trash situation. But with the other stuff, you have to actively, you know, choose to engage them for them to do anything. I mean, this will sit here with the same trash, but at least it's doing something. It feels like. Whereas, you know, with the other stuff, you're... Sometimes you're like, eh, good crystal rooms are the same. Okay. I don't know. Again. Okay, let's just go home. There's no limit to the amount of trash we can uh, acquire there. Maybe we'll head back out and try and do a trash run. Uh, Alright, we will see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.